Turn right back, well, not really quickly, uh, right back over to our matchup. We have John Nimbus. We have John Nimbus versus Jen. Finally, he heard my pleas. After I was so long, the return. <laughs> Literally okay, like two John. weeks ago, I was like, J Jen, come back. Come back, Jen. And um, he's heard my pleas. Specifically for uh, Xeno 233, we have Jen. Okay, of course, really great. Palu, amazing, amazing at spacing, uh, reading opponents, and also juggling. And John Numbers, we know John Numbers, amazing. We fit definitely more of a ledge play kind of person, but he's he's kind he's been experimenting with more uh, more aggro play recently. Oh yeah, absolutely. And I mean, I think you can tell John Numbers has been definitely having fun with his play recently. Already, we saw in like the first five seconds of the match, John Numbers thrown out a taunt. He's stretching his legs. He was like, "Watch this." Yeah, he's busy. He's, he definitely had been a little bit more loose since like, we came back from our little hiatus for a month and a half. So hopefully, we're gonna see something going here. But that back air, not back throw, not gonna quite take it yet. But that explosive flame, great dodging away from it. Yeah, and right now, Jen, Jen showing that he is not a man to be taunted already. Getting John Numbers' his first stock right there. John whiffing the uh, grab attempt. And Jen only sitting at 39, which is not a lot. <laughs> John Numbers already almost getting lapped in percentage just off of two interactions. And here we go, the Nair train, not quite good. Uh, Jen's really good doing those Nair, just Nair into up airs usually. He's not really too much of a, uh, a Nair train oh, person. That was such a good punish on the, uh, the header attempt. Getting that late uh, down tilt into the back air. John Numbers already looking to potentially lose his second stock, but a whiffed up smash is going to be giving John Numbers some stage position as well as a sun salutation. Right, deep breathing is back. So, I mean, wow. Ooh, and that's the Jen is second slowly time. not scared of challenging Numbers off the ledge. That and I the, love that. That is the second time that Jen has punished John Numbers for throwing out the header in that exact position. It's a habit that uh, that Jen is starting to exploit from Numbers. You know, we, typically we, we don't really know what to do with header uh, in that position. But Jen is like, I don't really care. I'm going to just do back air or, or up smash or anything against you. Just so you can just not do that. Oh, Reflecting the no. sun citation. I forget that she even has a reflector. They never use it. No. They never use it. But Which I mean, this is great for counts. catching. Yeah, definitely. Nah, when it counts, it counts. Like it, it just comes out of nowhere. You're, you don't, you don't expect it. Is his name Rush Hour? What good movies? That's all I think of. I, just, <laughs> I love Rush Hour. Yeah. And especially at that range too. That's a that's death. That's a pretty reactable range for Palutena to be thrown out of. Thrown out a, a reflector. And it was pretty charged up as well. Like, that was definitely death for John Numbers. Take first game going over Jen rather quickly. Something we don't really see very often over here at Xeno. You know, Numbers are right in a stock, in a stock deficit, or game deficit, really. Yeah, John Numbers wasting no time getting off stage, setting up that deep breathing. He is. We are probably going to be seeing a, a more business like John Numbers than a throw out a taunt in the yeah. first five seconds, John Numbers. I think Numbers completely forgot how Jen plays. Jen, again, very, very talented player, great at spacing, great at neutral, and great advantage. So, this is to me that Numbers has to really focus about focus on it. Kind of, maybe he has to go back to his uh, his more refined style of that, that, that ledge play. Mm -hmm. But right now, Jen really just not letting him such good spacing, but a good uh, get-up attack there by John Numbers is going to be getting him some more space. I thought that Paulo Backer completely just negates, like, some citation is so funny. It, it's so funny. Like, Ayo. Oh, and again, that, uh, that exact same spot where John Numbers has tried to threaten Jen with a header, but Jen uh, very smartly just going just below it and punishing John for it. But we're seeing a much more competitive uh, game two right now than we did in game one. John Numbers with a little bit of a percentage lead now. There we go. That was some mind games going on right there, you know. And we're throwing out uh, a few moves. And Jen just air dodging, and then John reading with the F to for himself is absolutely insane. I'm sorry, uh, I believe it was Fort. It was F smash. F smash, I think, yeah. I think Jen was I not. Low corner. <laughs> I think Jen was not expecting the uh, the deep breathing down tilt to have so much shield pushback. It it put like a whole character length in between him and John, uh, which of course made that shield grab whip. 
just barely missing the punish on that. Uh, Punishing the job right there, yep. Yeah, I think uh, John may have used the uh, invincible roll that is that, throw. that you can use for uh, uh, jab counterplay. John going right back to where he's comfortable, yeah. but he misses the deep breathing. Yeah, putting Jen him... just pressured him too much. Yeah, putting him in a bit of an unfortunate scenario. No soccer balls on deck, but a F tilt on shield is absolutely going to be punishable. Putting Jen off stage right now has to find his way off, but John Numbers keeping him on with the uh, the F air. <laughs> Tried to poke the soccer ball back, but just barely missed. I think I didn't see that much in the in the first game as well. John surprisingly not using soccer balls often as he is right now. Talking about kind of showing uh, John numbers that this is this is the play against Jen. You know, we have some citation which can reflect it, but we have soccer ball which he can kind of like manipulate his trajectory a little bit with his own attack. So something Jen has to really uh really keep up keep up on with, with soccer ball. Yeah, I'm, mm -hmm. I was gonna say that's that's just something that we've seen quite a bit from John uh, in the past couple of weeks is his more mastery over control of the soccer ball trajectories. You know, using those more unorthodox that trajectories. That's so, so nasty. It is. Full sun salutation on deck. Grab Great moves. mash out of uh, out of grab right there. Yeah, I don't think John Numbers was in a position where a throw would have killed. Nah. Ooh, but the but I air. think a throw would have been very useful. Well, yeah. But now Jen sitting, uh, Rage absolutely playing a part in getting John Numbers' second stock right now. Ooh, but the deep breathing only punishing with just the single nair. I really like John's use of the angled shield, not trying to get shield poked. I came right back on the stage. We have number. We have. Jen trying to keep control of center stage as much as he can, which is just, just fine with numbers. Numbers is great going on off the ledge as much as he could. Trying to get some soccer ball action going on. And wow, the, the absolute reversal. The hula hoops, I believe, knocked Jen out of his recovery. And then numbers used it to his advantage to, uh, to take that second stock off of Jen. Yeah, but I mean, it was almost a real bad situation for John. Uh, Jen was going for that same uh, soccer ball punish that we've seen so often where John Numbers throws it out off stage and Jen go just goes under it. Great spot dodge there, not getting grabbed. John Numbers now off stage, but fighting his way through with the header. Deep breathing now on deck. Both characters are very... Oh. What percent did he die at? He got clipped by the hula hoop at like 60. So that happened, that literally just happened in the second second as well. He got he got hit by hula hoops, and then John just simply just said, Hey, watch this back air. Yeah, right here, it happened once. Second stock. Jump yep. off right to back air, and then here comes the second game. 60% for Jen. <laughs> yeah, a 100% difference. Coming here. Jen still died for it. Same exact mistake. Hopefully, uh, kind of. He, he at that point he might have to kind of um, mix up with the timing of of Paulu's recovery, or he has to literally wait for numbers to get on the ledge. Because mm -hmm. the hula hoops do be hitting, and and, and and there's not fun. They do be hitting. They do be hitting though. All right, over over. Going to switch over to a uh, town and city. A uh, a changing platform stage uh, we've seen many times before. And it might be better in favor for a, a lot more space for Jen to really uh, run around in. And Numbers has to uh, be careful of these upper platforms that Jen can use so easily in order to convert into a back air or a uh, or a fair attack. And I think we're also probably going to be seeing the uh, side blast zones come into play. You know, Town yes. City blast zones, very close. And John Numbers definitely lived quite a few interactions offstage in the last game where he may have perished. You see that platform ex that extension three. platform? Oh, John Numbers, he's, mo he's schmoozing. Oh, Numbers, are we good? <laughs> oh, no, he he, he's shaking his head. Yeah, no, uh, but that was really beautiful footwork from num from Jen, actually, like, literally getting off the platform and jumping down and using that as an extension for himself to get that that that, that backer off of uh, off of Numbers. Like, literally, mwah. Beautiful. Now, John Chef's Numbers. kiss. Taking his time, getting the deep breathing. Jen just packing on a little bit of chip using the uh, using the auto radical. Ooh, all right, tried to look for a tech situation there with the F tilt, but John Numbers jumping away. I think uh, did 
Deep Breathing is gone now. John Number just hasn't been able to get too much out of Deep Breathing. Sun Salutation not definitely not going to be doing it across the stage like that. I think the reason he hasn't been getting Deep Breathing is Chen is so on him uh, off the stage. He's unafraid of Numbers being off the ledge uh, unless he's being, you know, caught in that hula hoop recovery option. Yeah, John just hasn't been able to yeah, find yeah, any combo starters, I think, in this, yeah, that in this as well. whole set. It's mainly been stray hits here and there and just extending advantage state rather than straight combo. Mm -hmm. So dash attack on shield is going to give Jen a jab opportunity, bringing John back off stage. Good sun salutation there to punish the down tilt. A little bit of whiff grab is going to be answered with another one. But John Numbers bringing this right back to even, uh, actually. Only a 10% difference, and John Numbers has been winning a lot of the recent interactions. Okay. Missing the supposed to fame right over there, and right now we have Numbers trying to get back on the stage, not able to get that forward, uh, that forward uh, air. But that... All right. All right, soccer ball, I see you coming in a little bit in clutch when, not, when your, your owner was gone. <laughs> a little funny, third player. Oh, and now no. we have a very serious situation where now we have the platform in Jen's, uh, in Jen's favor as an extension for himself. Yeah, such a well-timed down in city platform for Oh, Jen. that was beautiful automatical. Oh, that was a very risky deep breathing. John Numbers air dodging out of it, not getting back aired for it. But, I mean, this has just been Jen's stock so far. I think this is 89% unanswered and climbing. Oh, the Sun Citation right there. Finally, that's that, that stock from uh, from Jen, but he he has 0%. Numbers is old. Oh, please, Numbers is camera. I'm losing my mind. <laughs> okay, not getting hit by the, the down throw back air. Or the down tilt back air. John Numbers still back living the back it. throw. Yes. He absolutely will be uh -oh, taking uh -oh, it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, we're good. Jen taking it with a. 2-1 victory over John Numbers. I'm telling you, those platform extensions are exactly what he needed for uh, a lot of just, just, just chasing numbers when he's trying to recover. Yeah, that back throw is nasty. Mm -hmm. She's so pretty. <laughs> well, that I, said, I, I, just, I, I appreciate the art and work that goes into these models. Absolutely. I think Paulo is so pretty. She's literally a goddess. But before...